After some months of comparative calm, Algeria erupts into civil war as four retired French army generals lead the seizure of the city of Algiers and other key points. They are rightists who want the country to remain French. They have the aid of the units of the French Foreign Legion and the army. Algiers appears as calm as this, but there's an undercurrent of deep tension. In Paris, rebel bombings were a prelude to the worst terror France has suffered since the German occupation. Bombs made of plastic explosive that can be molded like putty were planted in two railroad stations and at Orly Airport. Several were injured and one man was killed. During a paratroop invasion by the rebels from Algeria, the airports were closed and then put under heavy guard, as was all Paris. People were called on to come en masse to the airfields, if an invasion threatened, by President Charles de Gaulle, who assumed dictatorial powers and appealed for unity. Une fois de plus, j'appelle tous les Français, quels qu'ils soient, où qu'ils soient, à se réunir à la France. Vive la République! Vive la France! 